obvious one off the bat here. What's been your experience at Coach Alley getting to work with him this spring? Uh, coach Alley is an amazing coach, man. He's very profound. You know what he's doing. Very experienced. Even though he's a relatively young coach, he knows that he knows a lot about football. You know what he's doing, and he's a great fit to the Oklahoma Center staff. Has it been any kind of an adjustment for you, really? Uh, not really, because I was a young guy coming in with Coach Roof, so the switches, the playbooks are still the same and everything, and it's still the same defensive coordinator and our same head coach, so most of the stuff's still the same. What's this spring been like for you just in terms of uh, maybe getting a little bit more opportunity to really make an impact this year? Uh, I'm blessed with the opportunity that I've been given, and one thing that Coach V says, it doesn't matter. You, you don't control the opportunities you're given, but you control how you control the opportunities. So I want to make sure to take full advantage of the opportunities that I'm given. How much different do things feel for you just physically and also mentally with where you're at this spring versus last spring coming in as a brand new freshman? I came in the summertime and uh, it's more comfortable. The game slowed down a little bit and it's better for me because I know what I'm doing. I'm trying, I'm trying to get know the responsibilities of the people around me so I can get a better uh, feeling of the defense and be able to play faster. Where are they working? Just, where are you playing at this spring? Uh, I'm trying to play everywhere. Try to get all, all across the field. In the context, just the depth of this this linebacker group feels like you guys are as deep as the position's been here in quite a while. I know this linebacker group is very special. We got a lot of depth. We got a lot of good players. We got a lot of people that can do a lot of good things. So watch out for the Oklahoma State linebackers team. It seems that Danny's kind of Danny and Jerem, the leader of that group. How much have they grown just in terms of leadership and you guys being able to kind of follow along as I guess they mentor you? Uh, Danny staying was a big thing. It was a big help. I ain't gonna lie because there's a lot of mental things about football and just understanding how football works and how the formation can adjust, uh, how, how the formation can tell if it's a pass play, run play, just simple IQ. That's why I'm really, I'm really appreciative of how Danny is teaching me and how they're just being good managers, be good mentors and good role models. I know that Danny's kind of talked about how there's a little bit of a good cop, bad cop going on with uh, Coach Alley and Coach Venable. <laughs> what, what is it about Zach that he's able to communicate with you guys so easily? Uh, like I said, he's, he's on the younger side and he really knows how to connect with us young guys and just talk to us and be there and know how we, we can relate and how we understand things and just be able to be open to us. What's been like going through everything last year with, with Lewis? Obviously, because you guys came at the same time and everything. You guys been able to kind of help each other out. Uh, yeah, Lewis, that's my brother. That's my dog, man. We've been working, trying to study the plays and everything, try to get right, and try to get, try to make sure that this upcoming season's our year. How much more time is Venable spending with you guys, uh, or I got more or less time is Venable spending with you guys now that Allie is here versus you know last fall before he got to Oklahoma? Uh, I think he's still trying to go over all. The position groups try to make sure and mentor that everyone's doing the right thing. But I think he's still, are you still, he's still in our in our drills and still coaching us up to make sure that we're doing the right thing, staying on top of the drills. How do you feel about that defensive front from what you've seen so far through three weeks of practice? You're gonna be good. Trust. What kind of uh, leap do you feel like guys like a, a Grayson Halt and then Devon's here? It sounds like they've had really good springs. What have you seen from them? Are they acting different? Do they know that there's an opportunity there? Those guys, they've been working, they've been working their butts off, and they're trying to fight for that spot, trying to fight for the opportunity to be great. And I know they're going to be great. They're going to keep working and fight for the D tackle spots.